Hey guys, how's it going and welcome to my workshop. You've probably printed something in the past, but you might have realized that 3D printing parts look much worse than injection molded plastic prototypes. So in this video, I'm going to explain how you can get a beautiful matte finish on your 3D printed prototypes in just a day. You start by priming your ABS or PLA 3D printed part. And by the way, I'll link all the materials below, but feel free to use the alternatives. One thing that I cannot stress enough is to shake your primer bottle properly. Oh, and don't forget your mask. After applying the primer, you should wait around 1 or 2 hours until the primer dries, and then start wet sanding with coarse grit sandpaper. Basically, this means that you should use around 180 grit, but approximately 120 to 240 grit will work just fine. As you can see, priming the part in advance allows you to see where you have sanded and where you haven't, which can save your time and effort. Just try to get as much of the original color of the 3D printed part you're sanding, and it should take around 20 minutes or more, depending on the size of the part. Feel free to repeat the priming and sanding process multiple times, but in my opinion, once or twice is enough for a matte finish. As you can see, the primer will fill in the small grooves of the 3D printed part, which makes the overall surface much smoother. Once you're tired with sanding, hopefully meaning that most of the original color of the 3D printed part is visible, you can start applying the second layer of primer. After it dries, you can finally apply your paint. Water-based paint will dry much quicker than non-water-based paint, so if you want to save time, please use water-based paint. Wait around 30 minutes to an hour to wait for the paint to dry, and then you can choose to apply some varnish, but note that spraying glossy varnish will not make a matte paint perfectly glossy. Anyways, thank you for watching my video and feel free to leave any opinions or comments down below. See you in the next one.